Hey everybody, welcome and welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, J Ross. I'm back with another video. I'm actually really excited about this video because I will be recreating, as you guys can tell by the title, I will be recreating one of my favorite, favorite, favorite YouTubers um, look. Um, I just found a look one day and I was like, oh my gosh, I wanna try that out. And the palette she has, I don't have it, but I was able to find the same shades in my Urban Decay Born to Run. So if you guys don't know who I'm talking about, like I said by the title, I am going to be following Makeup by Tammy or Tammy Clark's video. Um, using, I think she was using the Lottie London X Tweely Collection palette. She was using the eyeshadow palette and I don't have that palette nor do I know who Tweely is, but I know who Makeup by Tammy is. She works with Makeup Revolution, but Makeup Revolution is not like who she is. You know, like she's, she's a mom, she's, you know, she's, She's an influencer, she's a beauty blogger, she's just she's just amazing and I love her and I'm really excited and I want to do a look with I just I just want to do a look inspired by her and it's gonna be a little bit different because I have hooded eyes and Tammy doesn't have hooded eyes. So I'm gonna be trying a glitter cut crease with hooded eyes, which is something that I rarely see on YouTube, so or Instagram or anything like that. So this is gonna be fun for me, new for me and new experience. And also I couldn't wait to do this. I'm just wiping off my eye, nothing on this. Uh, this was sponge was used for my powder, but there's nothing really, really on it. I'm just using it to stop my lids from, you know, being oily if they are. Like I said, it, I'm starting to get hot already, but my base still looks good though, so we're good. Oh, also I'm going to be using some new brushes that I just got in this set. Um, these are the eye brushes I'm going to be using. They are labeled one by one. This is from the Eye On Beauty, not Eye On, it's literally called Eye On Beauty Complete Eye and Face Luxury Kit. I got this from like Marshalls or TJ Maxx and so these are the face brushes and then I've already taken out the eye brushes. Um, so I think it's a set of 12 brushes. Oh, 10 brushes. Set of 10 brushes, and like I said, these are the face brushes, these are the eye brushes. This is the foundation brush, the bronze and glow brush, the contour definition brush, and powder contour brush. So that's what those are. I'll be using those in a later video, but like I said, my face is already done, and it's all about the eyes. And I wouldn't be using a new eye brush kit if I didn't already know this palette. I've already used this palette, so um, because I've already used this palette, this is why I'm using brushes that I'm not familiar with. Let's go ahead and start following Tammy's directions. I'm gonna start with this one right here, which is called Chikatarian. Oh my gosh, this is actually super pigmented. It shows up beautifully on my skin tone. So I'm just buffing and blending that into the crease. Let's go with Red Velvet, which is this kind of muted reddish burgundy maroon color and I'm just gonna put that straight into the crease as well to deepen it up I'm gonna mix hey guys with no tea no shade so the black with the dark brown just a small amount of it and just deepen this even Crease is cut. Now I'm gonna go in with the blue shade, which is called Rebel for Life. And I'm just gonna pat that onto the center of the eye. I'm gonna go for Shook, which is this beautiful, light, kind of greeny teal color. And I'm gonna put that right there. So here is the part where I think she's about to cut the crease. And like I said, I have a hooded eye, Ham Tammy, Tammy. Tammy does not. So this is going to be absolutely new for me. And I'm also using a completely new product because I've never glitter cut the crease. I've never actually like literally lined the cut crease. So this is gonna be fun and new and exciting. Just pray for me as I do this. So I'm gonna be using the Revlon Photo Ready Eye Art lid line lash 
So this has that skinny tip or whatever to it. And like I said, this one is the eyeshadow so it should have a doe foot applicator if I'm not mistaken. Yes, so there is that. And this one is in the shade Topaz Twinkle. So she is using part of Lottie London X Tweelies collection. I think it was like a glitter gel. Um, and she's gonna use the color gold. Um, this is like a champagne gold, so that's why I'm gonna use. Has like reflections of gold and then it has like an iridescent like shift. So we're gonna hope and pray. And I'm not gonna talk to this and I'm just gonna keep going throughout my life. So y'all pray for me. So now what we're gonna do is go in with the Diamond Dip Face on Body Gel, Glitter Gel, and this is called So Instagrammable and it is gold, like I said. Okay, so I'm gonna take some of that glitter onto the brush, but I'm gonna tap it off on my hand to make sure I don't have too much product. about this that I tried I do like it I actually like it I want to buy more colors because I think it's like eight different versions of these I want to buy more I do want to try the eyeshadow one time because I've never tried like a liquid eyeshadow that's like this or comes from like a pot or anything I am like actually excited that I tried the cut crease and I want to thank Tammy um, if she's watching or if she at least sees this on Instagram or whatever I want to thank Tammy for the inspiration behind this look um like you, like I said earlier like Tammy is somebody that like she's younger than me um but she's been in the beauty community longer than I have and she's just such an inspiration she's such like I so wish I could meet her because there's like so many things I would say to her thank you for being just like an outspoken person but at the same time you stay to yourself like she lets no beauty community drama like phase her just seems like such a kind and sweethearted person it's just like I look up to her so 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 much and some of the looks that she does I'm just like oh my gosh I want to try that so I was just like you know what I'm gonna stop saying I'm gonna do that or want to try that and just go ahead and do it and like I think it turned out absolutely amazing only thing that I can say is like I know my blue is not as vibrant as hers because I didn't have a vibrant blue like that but overall I'm still happy with the way it looks and I hope to see more great things from her because I think she really deserves a chance to just like have her way like she has two eyeshadow palettes but I feel like there's some things that Tammy could like actually perfect or not perfect but at least like get her hands on and actually bring to forefront for us melanin girls us us melanin us women of color us people of color like we need to see something from like a drugstore or affordable brand that's just like i can wear that i don't need these like fair pale medium skin tone people coming out with complexion products for them as well as oh I'm gonna dip into the shades for you guys too and then it's just like one size is supposed to fit all and it don't fit all like it don't it don't, it don't feel like you know your mama your mama's mama your cousin your uncle twice removed if he wear makeup you know that's that's on him but he can do whatever he wants I feel like she could be that person something that we can use like the highlighters are like a bronzy brassy golden nice color shade and the bronzers are like that golden warm not that red bright ashy looking contour type stuff no we don't need that and i thank you all for watching please let me know um how do you feel about this look do you think i did a good job let me know down below in the comments if you think there's anybody else you think i could do or follow a makeup look for i'm so happy that i did it even on a hooded eye like of course once i open my eyes like the cut crease kind of goes away which is why i tried to like bulk up the lining a little bit so you can still sort of see it all right guys, so that wraps it up for me. Once again, I am your girl, Jay Ross. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please follow me on social media. Please like, share, and subscribe to this channel as well as to this YouTube video. 
and I will see you guys in my next one once again thank you to my girl not my girl because I don't know her personally but I feel like we just right there thank you so much to makeup by Tammy aka Tammy Clark for giving me this inspiration to do this look I will link her social media down below as well as the video to this look of where I got the inspiration from and I will catch you guys in my next one so well further ado I'm just going to just roll with that because I keep saying that you know I don't be wanting to say that and I just want to send this video off and I always mess that up so yeah I'm just gonna go ahead and say later guys so I'll catch you guys in my next one peace